everybody, I am walking in Thousand Pines here and I will be looking for some cars, the ones that will catch my eye. I am Supercar 8000 and if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe now for more awesome content. So right now it's sundown and I'm walking around to see which cars are around here. I'm also joined here by Danilo Alcantara and he will be joining me looking for cars. So Danilo Alcantara, what do you have to say about if what we're going to going to happen so far if we're going to find good cars or we're not going to find good cars? Um, there's not really good cars but there are like some Fiat Acuras and a classical Corvette which is our big goal. There's also a 2013 Ford Mustang but it's usually in the garage and a classical and a really classical convertible car but the garage is closed unfortunately. Okay so thank you for that info. Um, just about a few houses from now we will be seeing a Fiat 500C. Um, it, it is about a few houses from now the sun is bright, so if that's a disturbance to you, take the video off right now. I see a squirrel crossing the road. And right there, there's a Pontiac and an Acura. But that's not such an interest to the public, not unless if they're huge fans of Pontiacs and Acuras. But anyway, still, if you're a fan of these two cars, I will be passing them right now. The Acura is the dark red one over there behind, and the Pontiac is an SUV, this bright red one over here, and that's the Acura. And this house also has a Tesla and a Porsche Cayenne. There isn't a car approaching us, so we're going to have to stop this video. So we're going to pause it. Okay, that car just passed us. So sorry about the disturbance of the sun. It's sun down Florida. It's really nice. And if you were to ever visit. Look, a centipede. A millipede. Over there. Oh, we just got disturbed by a millipede here, which caught our eye on the road. But anyways, it's just a little bit of details to add to the video. It's a millipede. It's a very pretty one. A lot of those small, huge legs. I'll pick it up. See here. Here's the millipede. Well, I like a centipede. Oh, I like centipedes. I like my bugs. It's awesome here. For soup. I can't catch these, but right I shall now let put it, it down. It's now back into the na its natural habitat. And now I shall be keep on walking here looking for cars. Up here, if you're a huge fan of trucks, I shall be capturing a truck. The truck is over here. It is a Ford truck. Oh gosh, that sun's bright. I think it's a Ford 150. Not sure. But anyways, let's just keep on walking. Okay, up here is the Fiat we promised you. The 500C is coming up. Um, you're going to like this Fiat. It's actually pretty nice. It looks like a Mini Cooper a little bit, but in fact, it's actually not. The Fiat 500C is this car right here. Hello, people. The Perhaps car is right here. That's the Fiat 500L. The, no, 500C. I mean, now, sorry about this incoming disturbance. There's the car, if you're interested. It's a Fiat, if you need it. It will be a long walk. We will be doing part one and part two. Well, probably not unless we don't see anything. <laughs> Hello everybody, um, I'm back after a few minutes. We are gonna be on a delay of an upcoming Porsche. So if you wanna see it, we're gonna capture it for you. It's a Cayman.
Yeah. And the person right next to me, he's also filming yeah. a car. Good that job. car, but it's a yeah, nice Porsche. Up here we have a Ford. And a Toyota is over here. In a YouTube already. Yeah. Here is um, a Toyota on this house, and there's a Mercedes Benz in this house with a joined by a Ford. So there's a Mercedes Benz, and a Ford is in there. I'm definitely not a fan of Cadillacs, but I'm just doing this in case if all of you that are probably watching this video are fans of Cadillacs. The red car between the trees over there is a Cadillac. I can't get a closer view. Sorry about this um, uh, failing thing. I'm once again very sorry, but the red, just so you know, the red car is a Cadillac. I'm going about to get in between the rear end. By the end, you can tell it's a Cadillac. Not all the time the sunsets here in Florida are nice. Like right now, the sunset may look beautiful from the beginning of the video, but it's actually starting to thunder a little bit. There's an approaching dark cloud over there. But anyways, we're just gonna keep on going. Our main theme here is to see if we can capture a classical Corvette. There's a chance we can, but we're also going to be spotting a lot of cars on the way here. On the way, how I said in the beginning, if I did not mention it, it's sorry for the inconvenience. So right now we're going to be turning, and I'll catch up with you guys later. According to Danilo Alcantara, he says there is a Corvette classical one coming. He says it's around this neighborhood. I don't know if it's possibly two. But if you keep watching this video, we're going to find out if there is actually a classical Corvette. So if, Danilo Alcantara, what if, do you have to say about this? If there is not, then it is in the garage. Because every day at Tassler, there's a light blue classical Chevy Corvette. Okay, thank you for those words. So we just need to keep on looking to see if we actually have the luck to find it. Right now, it is still a long walk from here. That's why I am skipping some of the videos. And I'm pretty sure almost none of you are interested in Lincolns. So I know there's a Lincoln up here. There's I don't a know. Lincoln and a Cadillac limousine. Is it a limousine? Yeah. It's a Lincoln limousine? Yeah, according to Danilo Contra, he's saying it is a limousine of the car manufacturer Lincoln. Lincoln is an American car manufacturer. It is a very nice car company. Some are not so nice, but uh, you, if you see the Lincoln Hybrid, it's the new one. It's so awesome. And the luxurious Lincoln, they're rocking it off. Um, so if you're interested in the Lincoln, I'm just going to show you the limousine. I don't know if I'm going to have the success to show you, but at least I can show you the front row. See the little black car over here? The limousine is over here. Can you see it? See, there is a car. It's a beautiful car. Even though it's kind of the Rolls Royce. The Rolls Royce limousine is cooler, but all limousines have their designs. But the Lincoln has a typical design. You can see it's actually a stretch limo. If you can see the car between the trees, you can see its pattern. And they also have a Cadillac in here, I believe. Yes, as you can see. Yeah, thanks. The Cadillac is over here. That's the Cadillac over there. And now we're going to keep on going. I know what else we're gonna find. Okay, it's actually just starting to thunder a bit strong, and there's. I'm gonna see if there's gonna be a chance we're gonna make it to the Corvette. But anyways, that huge cloud over there it doesn't look so pretty. Um, but at least if it's gonna rain over that, Danilo Contra wants to say something. In this house, there's usually an Audi S4, but not today, okay? 
Alright, thanks for that update. I think the people watching this video will actually need it. Okay, so we're here already, and according to Danilo Contra, <laughs> he's saying that the Corvette is there. Oh, uh, but we're gonna see if we can see it. According to him, oh yeah, look at that sweet ride. I'm gonna get a closer look for you guys. The Corvette is over here. That's the Corvette. Now, we're gonna keep on looking. If you want a closer look, I'm gonna see about that. Anyways, I'm gonna try. Here, I'm coming to get a better look at the Corvette. That's the Corvette, ladies and gentlemen. And now we're gonna keep on looking. Oh, real quick, I'm just going to get one more glare because it's a very beautiful car. So we got what we came for. But anyways, um, I think we're going to keep on walking. Hey, Danilo Alcantara, are we going to keep on walking? Um, I don't know. Well, that's all for us now. Thanks for joining us. If you like the Corvette, please subscribe for more content, and we'll give you more. Please, and if you haven't subscribed, subscribe to Supercar 8000, and then subscribe also to Danilo Alcantara's channel. Thanks for watching, and one last time, thanks for watching. Bye.